I didn't really know what to expect, but it just added to the adventure. No civilization, just nothing. We're about to send it. You're about to do what? Like I'm about to do a full send. Like like I'm about to go full Larry on this. Attempting to define something and call it an overlander is good and fun, but you just gotta get out and do it. You may think it is our branches, but it's not. It's actually a... Uh... Canadian gnomes that live out in the wilderness, right? <laughs> the dogs and their things just want to say hi to me. Probably one of the highlights of my uh, overlanding experience for the last <laughs> three years. Hasn't been a lot of vegetables on this trip. It's been a lot of like meat and beer. This is for Ren. We have a solution. Until the wind changes complete directions, then we're off. Thank you so much, you're so gracious. Oh, okay, well we're gonna keep it here for now. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> I put my vote in for this, which was let's get as far north as we possibly can. Maple syrup all the way. I hate mayonnaise. Five years ago when I had this vision of Mountain State Overland, I envisioned us traveling the entire range of the Appalachian Mountains over three to five years and we did it. 